is yet. Here's little brother. Mascardo Bros in Hawaii. <laughs> yep. There we go. Shout out to the other big bro. What's good, y'all? So this is the daily vlogs that I'll have that's outside of the Hawaii vlogs that I have already. Um, our first stop is actually, we're at a cemetery and we're here to see our older brother. So it's been a, lo a lot of years, so I guess, you know, I can say this publicly. Basically, I was we were both supposed to have an older brother. Uh, his name was Bonino, Nino for short. And he was supposed to be a year older than me. His birthday was supposed to be May 16, 1992. And um, yeah, my mom had a stillborn, you know. Uh, she got really sick, I guess, during her first pregnancy. Like, it's just what happened. Mom, um, if you're ever watching this, I hope you're not mad that I'm sharing this story. But, you know, at least you have both of us now. <laughs> I do have this theory, though. I have this theory that God gave Nino a second chance, and then that's me. So, I don't know. I don't know, man. Like, maybe that's why I'm a Gemini. You know, that's like the whole twins thing. All the Zodiac fanatics are like, oh! <laughs> I bought some flowers too. You know, it's been years since anyone has visited him. This is the only family we have left here in Hawaii. Uh, our auntie and uncle moved to Portland about three, four years ago. So now, like, it's only him here in the island of Oahu. Let's get a close up of the tombstone. Yes. Nino B for Billotindos, which is my mom's maiden name, Mascardo. And then the epitaph is so small, so sweet, so soon. So basically our older brother was a Sour Patch Kid. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, where are we at, Nick? What's it called? Oh, I forgot. Oh, um, Botanical Garden. <laughs> well, what's the first name? Uh, uh, um, uh. <laughs> We're at the Ho'o Maluhia Botanical Gardens. It's pretty busy. We just got lucky with parking. It's all good. We're just gonna walk around. I honestly just came here just to do an Instagram photo. So hopefully, you know, we can make that work out. Look at the view of this mountain. It looks tight. We're technically not supposed to uh, take a photo along the roadway. We'll do it anyways. What would you bring in your canoe? What would you bring in your canoe? Am I picking amongst the flowers? No, anything. I don't know. <laughs> a fishing pole? There you go. I'll probably bring some weed. <laughs> What'd you say that looks like, Nick? That looks like a lion turtle. <laughs> to all the Avatar fans. So I'm trying to take this picture in the middle of the road. And you're not allowed to take pictures in the middle of the road. And then Someone already stopped me, like, hey, you're not supposed to. Like, fuck. So we're trying to time it right while all these cars are going through. And then just like real quick go in the middle and then take it. Hopefully it's good. Hopefully it's good, Nick. I'm gonna trust you. We got it. We got it. We literally ran to the middle, took these photos. Like, check it out. Check out. Check out this one. Oh, let it. Wanna focus? Right there. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> yeah, that's dope. Alright, we're here at Waikiki Beach. I have, you know, a quick soak in the water. It looks real good. You know, it's been hot today, but it's feeling nice. So, yeah, let's get in this water. Let me switch to the GoPro. Yo, Nick stepped on a sea urchin. Ugh, it's deep. Look at that. Woo. All right, we're gonna try to like get some out. We're about to hike up to the Makapu'u Lighthouse Point. I heard this hike's pretty short. It says online that it'll take about 30 minutes and it's just an incline walk up. So should be chill really early in the morning. There's a lot of people here already, but you know, still gonna be good. So yeah, let's get it.
there's a lighthouse right over there. It's cool. Check out the view though. Hey, hey. Check out that view over there. Also dope. Back at the car. It was a pretty chill hike. Super humid even though it's 9 a.m. But it is summertime. How'd you like the hike, Nick? It was a good hike, nice and simple. A lot yeah. of bugs on top though. Yeah, this, there were hella bugs. But um, yeah, the whole road was on asphalt. So, you know, you don't really have to wear like hiking shoes or anything. I've seen people with slippers. Obviously I'm in Jordans and yeah, still cool. All right, on to the next spot. We're here at Shark's Cove in North Shore. It's a really cool snorkeling spot. Uh, we're about to get ready right now. And yeah, just check it out. And the weather's really good. So about to have some fun. Here we are, Shark's Cove. Ooh, it looks so nice. Hell yeah. That was a dope snorkel session. That was cool. Saw a hell of fish. Went through an underground cave. So yeah, just reapplying some sunblock. You know, not trying to get burned. Uh, yeah. Quick tip, uh, don't wear nice Jordans onto the beach. But it's cool. I'm not gonna sell this, but if I ever sell it, I'm just gonna say VNDS. <laughs> We're here at La Ie Point. It's a famous cliff jump spot. If you've seen Forgetting Sarah Marshall, this is where Jason Siegel and Mila Kunis jumped off. So that's where we're at. We're gonna jump off, have some fun. All right, here's the jumping point. Seems chill. Just 30 feet, not bad. Hey, you better be careful, man, unless you're gonna jump with all your things. I know. Holy shit. Scared? It's just the anticipation. Are you scared though? But you're gonna jump once I jump, right? I will jump. Okay. Promise. Woo! Holy shit. Okay. Fuck! Woo! It's super chill. <laughs> you just jump. Just jump forward. <laughs> Got it! Yay! Hey! The jump was fun, but climbing up was not the shit, man. That tide was strong. We got cut up. Let's see, my leg. Hope oh, you can see that right there. Cut up. Right there too. You got some on your back. Do I got some on my back? You wanna you wanna show it? Yeah. How bad is it on my back? Not that bad. You got a few down here, and that's it. Yeah, that tide was that tide was making me tackle the rocks, man. That shit was not. Uh, you just got your lower back, really. Really, my lower back. Uh, I think it's gone, but oh no, yeah. If you lower it just a little bit, yeah. Right. Oh fuck! Is it bad? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no! It's a big line. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, but like EA Point, hey, come through to jump the cliff, man. It's it's kind of fun, so it's good. When the tides you right. Yeah, when the tide's right. My brother and I are here at Electric Beach. This is honestly the best place to snorkel in Oahu. I'm super hyped, the weather looks really good. The tide isn't too crazy, which means hopefully we'll see some turtles because that's what we're looking for. So we're about to set up camp at the beach and then let's go ahead and snorkel. Let's get it. So right here is where we set up camp. Yes, sir.
don't know if you can tell how tan I am. But snorkeling was hella fun. What'd you think, Nick? That one was hella fun. I'm telling you, best <laughs> snorkeling spot. If you're ever in Oahu, go to Electric Beach. It's about 30 minutes away from Waikiki. It's pretty tight. I don't know, my brother's swagging with these slacks. <laughs> we're about to go to Walmart because we're about to pick up our pasalubongs for our family. Chocolate covered macadamia nuts. Five top three boxes and a box of brushes. <laughs> nice. Go pay. Um, you can do five ones if you can. Oh. At least you brought your luggage too. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you for this.